But what is God's gift to offset that? His unconditional love that he loved you before you knew him and that he has provided everything you need for your salvation, including the facing of judgment. Judgment is not a fearful thing. Judgment is part of the gospel. It's part of the best news in the whole world because Jesus has already met the demands of the law, okay? We're born under the law. That's Galatians 4, 4, if you write it down. Jesus was born under the law, which meant he was born under condemnation. And he met that condemnation and paid the penalty. Our judgment has already been found in, his fa in our favor in him. I put in his favor. Romans 8, 1 to 4. Therefore, considering now how we see judgment, here's Paul explaining this in Pauline theology. And let me explain Paul to you. When we read Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, we are looking at Eastern mindset. We're looking at the way people in Israel think. We're looking at it through the culture of the Eastern culture. It's actually oral tradition. Paul, on the other hand, is speaking in the context of how people think in the West. It is called Western thought. Have you ever heard of Western thought? So when we read Paul's writing, the reason it is so different, Paul is writing the way they think in Europe and in the United States. He is writing the Western gospel in Western thought the way people think outside of the Eastern culture. That's why Paul sounds so entirely different. But Paul is speaking to us here in this room. And here's how Paul 